So it's Sunday after Boxing Day and i am decided I'm doing a little bit of learning today. Um, I've got Skillshare up so I'm learning. I'm just going through it to see if there's anything interesting I can use for getting a bit more savvy with social media and things like that. But specifically for writers, there's not an awful lot to be honest. There is for social media, but it's more as if when you've got a business and I know you'd say that writing is a business uh, I've not quite got there yet I'm just doing the basics first and then I'll maybe get to it but uh, yeah I've got some interesting I found uh, Bonnie Baguley from Wild Mind Creative for Authors it seems quite interesting, so I might look up more of her stuff and see what else there is. But at the moment, I'm just enjoying some learning. So, my plans... Hold on, I need to mute my TV. I'm watching Kate Kavanagh's live stream. <laughs> so I switched the TV off instead. Well done, Jackie. Um... Yes. See how quickly I forget what I'm saying. Right, so uh, I wanted to show you today, just because um, I've been doing a lot with my notebooks and things like that, and I watch people's, you know, videos and what they use their notebooks for. And I always find it quite interesting. I know not everybody does, but I do. So... I'm going to start off with some I'm not quite sure what I want to use for just yet, but I have them. So I have this little guy. Now this is a zipped thing. And it came with, I don't know if you can see that, a little star. And it's kind of holographic. Oh, look at that. Um, and this, it was in a reduced to clear bit in the local shop. And um, yeah. I thought, a pound? Yep, don't mind if I do. So, uh, this wasn't the notebook that came with it. This is a different one. I didn't like the one that it came with. So, I've got this, and I don't know what I'll use this for. I'm not sure. And it's the same with this one, because it was also reduced to clear in the same. But this is a padded one. It's squishy. And I like that. Uh... This is one I just decorated myself because why not? You know, it's got this clear fold and then I just put that image there. I want to start, because I'm also reading, I don't know, that's the kind of paper. This came with... This, that notebook came with these Lilac Lemon... Lerman, I can't remember these these notebook covers you know you get them like that it came with that uh, so yeah yes as I was saying I want to start reading and writing more horror mainstream horror and like fantasy horror so I've got this and I've also got these little notebooks that I made, and you can see they have uh, like Junji Ito stickers on them. So that could be what I use for horror ideas and things like that. Maybe outlining some stories and things like that. Now that's an interesting one. So this is another one of these. No, let's just tell me what fabric it is. Oh yeah, it's a smart fit. I don't know if you can see that. Lie it lab. Lie hit, lie hit. Something like that. Lab. And I've just, again, these are notebooks from... This, I've decked, this is washi tape. And it's just blank little notebooks from the local shop. And... I did have a reason for getting these and I didn't, I used something different. So now I've got these and I'm not sure what I want to do with them, I think. 
I might do some sort of life journaling in these. Maybe different aspects, maybe a self-care, a creativity because I don't just do writing. I maybe just a reflections. That's an idea. So I like this one because I also got that little magic potions. Um, it's an embroidery thing that you just throw on. So, I might as well show you this one. I want to use this as my sort of learning uh, notebook. So I'd started doing... You've got three in here. Ugh. He's a big bee found. You know, there's two thin ones. And then there's the bigger one at the back. So I think I put in my vlog that I was on Skillshare. So I can use put my notes in that for whatever aspects. And I also want to start doing this. Now Kate Kavanagh mentioned it in one of her latest videos and it just so happens at the beginning of the year I like to go through this because that's when I find, you know, at the end of the year, especially the end of 2020, I found my creativity was kind of at an all time low year started it. So I'm going to just go through this quickly again. I'm not going to do everything extensively. I really just kind of go through it to kind of just kickstart my creativity a little bit, you know, give it a little boost. And uh, I found that is really quite good for it. So I'll be using these notebooks for my learning. Because you're never too old to learn things. Uh, so other little notebooks. This one, I've put notes on them. This one, it just says Girl Boss on it. And it will be marketing and income ideas, strategies, anything to do with that. I'll put in this notebook here. This one here is for um, reading. So it'll be video ideas, bookstagram ideas, anything like that that I can think of will go in this little book here. I think I'll put my sticky tabs back on so I remember once I've done all this. And then other ones I want to do for social media is this is for Instagram as you can see and this is another really nice one I have two of these I don't know where the other one is so probably upstairs so with that and it's lovely reflective so that'll be for Instagram ideas people to follow that sort of thing you know recommended accounts and these two one was for my Jacqueline Kirk Facebook page and this one I'll do for my Jacqueline Morgan Facebook page. And since it's Jacqueline Morgan is romance based, I thought it pre the pretty pink with gold feathers on suited that fine. So, like I said, these are notebooks that I've had for ages and they've sat doing other. So, I've decided a, doing a book buying ban and also probably a notebook banning. But book, notebook by ban for this year as well. Or at least until I run out, which probably never will because I've still got a lot. Uh, this one, I think I've shown this before, I think, and I was using it for book reviews just for myself. And I kind of got out of the habit and I'll pick that up and start using that one again. These here are for... It's just basically laminated pictures and elasticated ring and then just an A4 composition notebook and I will use that for screenplays because I find with screenplays if I write it out first longhand it's much easier because I don't have to concentrate so much on the format and things like that. I can just sit it on my lap put some music on or whatever and just sit and write. So that is those ones. I do have other ones. I have this one. It's a little one and it's a dot grid. It's, this is actually just a cover and you can put this in. And I had started using it as a bullet journal but kind of got out of the way of it. 
uh, this one. Now this one I will be using and I did start to then I never got around to doing it and I think I've shown you this before. Uh, just putting in aesthetic boards and I've got a whole pile here in, with different themes in that and this is just to kind of inspire stories and things like that so I've put them into sort of different these are dark darker ones uh, yeah just to inspire story ideas and things like that so the ones at the front are the ones I've chosen that I haven't actually written because there's still a notebook there no paper sorry um, yeah and just something else just to kind of inspire me and this is another cover I got. This was just a little cheap one off of Amazon and it comes with its own handle. But it has pockets on the front. No, oh, don't a minute. These pockets in there. Inside has, this was a, a notebook from, yeah, it's a local supermarket. And these stickers were Halloween stickers from the local shop. It has another little pocket in there, <coughs> little pockets here. I'm not good at keeping this in frame today, am I? Little pockets here and here. So they're a bit like the La Lyot Lab, whatever these ones are called. Yeah, so this again, I like this. All right decorated with washi tape because it looked really nice and I'm not sure what I'll use this for if I'll just use it for notes when I'm out and about because I can just like I said I can just put this in my bag because it's supposed to be like waterproof if you spill on it anything on it it's waterproof and this is actually yep no free shrees I have no idea what that's called. See, you can see it there. That's the name on it, if anybody's interested. I just like the fact that it came with a, <laughs> came with a handle. <laughs> Don't know why, just look fun. Um, but like I say, that was, it wasn't very inexpensive on Amazon. So that is that for my notebooks. It's really just to utilise what I've got, put them to use, and also it compartmentalises all the different things that I need to keep on top of. Because I would like to get very organised this year to make it a very productive month. No, sorry, a very productive year. Let's hope 2021 is a bit kinder than 2020 has been to everybody everywhere so that's it let me know what notebooks you're using if you have a, a very large notebook collection like a lot of us creative people do and uh, like comment subscribe and i will speak to you soon okay bye